Hey, what's up, everybody? It is your host and friend once again, PCJ, the original Pop Culture Junkie, here to share with you my final subscription box unboxing of the month, or for the year, actually, of 2018, because we're coming up on the very last few days of 2018. And what better way to finish off the year but by checking out my December 2018 That Wrestling Club subscription box. Of course, my favorite wrestling subscription box available. Now, in case any of you are wondering, hey, what happened to November? Because I didn't post a video last month, and I have been subscribing to That Wrestling Club from the very beginning. You know, some people were like, hey, did you just not want to do a video last month? Did you decide to skip a month? And of course not, because I love That Wrestling Club subscription box, so why would I ever skip? Unfortunately, my November box went completely missing because the post office uh, gave my box to somebody else. That's right. I, I have a P.O. box, and my box show delivered. I go to the uh, post office. I speak to them said, hey, it shows delivered. I don't have anything in my box. Can you check to see if it's, you know, you just didn't put it in there yet. Maybe it's on your back shelf. And the employees informed me that the manager of the branch that you know operates there put all the boxes into people's PO boxes and I spoke to that person and she said oh yeah yeah I put I put all the boxes up and I said okay well why is it not in my PO box and the employees uh were the ones that were told me oh uh apparently she put your box in someone else's PO box and whose ever PO box that she put it in they already took whatever was in their box out and why give it back or why return it, right? <laughs> so my November box was uh, given away to somebody else and uh, that person didn't, you know, want to be honest and return it to the post office counter or let them know, hey, this was in my box mistakenly. They instead just got a free wrestling subscription box. That totally sucks for me because I missed out on November's box and later on I got to watch uh, other people's unboxings and see what was in there. So was really disappointed that I did not get to have November's box and I'm still waiting for the claim to go through uh, on that. So just in case anyone was wondering about what happened with November's video, that's why there was no video because the post office uh, manager gave away my box to someone else uh, in their PO box and then that person never cared to return it. So yeah, uh, that's what happened. So at least I got my December box. So thankfully uh, it took like an extra week for whatever reason. I mean, yeah, it's the holiday season, but uh, it, show, it should have been delivered over a week ago, uh, but yeah, my post office are just, they're, they're, they're just really bad. <laughs> Anyways, we got the December That Wrestling Club box. If you're a first time viewer, That Wrestling Club doesn't necessarily do a theme, they just have random, awesome wrestling items, so whether you're a casual fan or hardcore fan, you're going to love it. And if you have not subscribed to That Wrestling Club before, take advantage of my promo code Pop Culture Junkie. that will save you 10% at checkout on your first subscription box, so check out that. And check out the link below so you can subscribe. Let's get on to the unboxing and let's see what they included for the final box of the year for 2018. And uh, they've already announced on uh, social media that they have big plans for next year. So if you haven't subscribed yet, get in and join the club and you're going to be part of some really cool stuff that they have planned for next year. So let's check out the box. Let's see what's inside. And we're going to go in completely blind. Let's see here. First item... Uh, we have some socks coming out. Oh, these are really nice. We've got the uh, odd socks. We've had some of these before. And these are the Ultimate Warrior. That's pretty awesome. I don't care what people say. You know what? I mean, the human being, Warrior, was a different person from the uh, wrestling persona. And the wrestling persona I loved as a kid. Uh, you know, the human being, different story, of course. But... Love the Ultimate Warrior. Okay, I always got excited. He was at my first wrestling show I got to see live. I got to see him versus Undertaker at my very first uh, wrestling show. So, you know, big fan, of course. We got a t-shirt coming out. This is kind of a... Oh, I like it. It's a, it's not white. It's a beige off-white color. And I know there's been talk lately. And people are like, you know what? I don't like the, uh, you know, just black shirts. Or I don't like, you know, multicolor shirts. Whatever. I'm like... I say just change it up, make a different color shirt every month and be like, look, it's going to be a blue one this week or, or this month. It'll be a red one next month, green one next month, etc. So I say just change it up. You know, I've got a lot of black shirts in my closet <laughs> from uh, from subscription boxes. So we got an Andre the Giant t-shirt and I think it looks awesome. And it says there, eighth wonder of the world. That's really nice. I like it. 
If anybody hadn't watched it, I recommend if you are able to watch it, uh, check out that Andre the Giant documentary that was on uh, HBO uh, earlier this year. That was a really good show. I really enjoyed that documentary. Uh, my wife uh, got a big kick out of watching it too. It was really interesting. A lot of things she got to learn about Andre the Giant because she didn't really grow up a wrestling fan, so she got to learn a lot more uh, about the guy. That was really good. All right. We, ooh, I feel a pop. What do we have here? We got a Funko Pop. And, haha, we got Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Awesome. Okay, unfortunately, I just bought this one. <laughs> uh, I didn't expect them to have this one in the box. Uh, but, yeah, I just bought this one about a week or two ago. But, oh, well, I'm happy to have another Ronda Rousey Funko Pop because hopefully I can get this one autographed if I get to ever go to any uh, shows that she's at and doing any kind of appearances or whatnot. I'm sure... Maybe only like Mania will she do, you know, signings or whatnot. Who knows? You know, maybe she'll do other appearances and signings at like a Rumble or SummerSlam if they come to Houston again and such. Uh, but yeah, hopefully would get the chance to meet her and uh, get an autograph on the uh, pop. That'd be awesome. All right, what else we have in here? I'm feeling okay. We have a pen, and you know me, I love their enamel pens. Ah, oh, this is nice. I like when they do characters, and this is what we have this month is a character pen. We've got Bray Wyatt, who we haven't really seen in a while now, and I'm hoping, hoping when he does come back on uh, Raw or SmackDown uh, that you know, he gets a proper push, proper run. I mean, come on, he's a former WWE champion. Give the guy a you know, proper run. I'd like to see him just put together the uh, Wyatt family again and just have him tear through everybody. That'd be awesome. All right, cool pin, cool pop, and great shirt. And last but not least, we've got our autograph. Oh, 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 we've got two autographs, and I'm impressed. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, here's a reason right now. If you have not subscribed to that wrestling club before, okay, you get, like you see here, great shirts, awesome custom pins, Funko Pops. They've had elite figures. They've had all sorts of cool things. And they've had amazing autographs in their boxes. From day one, our very first autograph was a personalized signed photo from the Immortal Hulk Hogan. That was our first uh, first month. Uh, we've had uh, Ric Flair, Bret Hart. We've had AJ Styles, Seth Rollins. Okay, so many different legends and amazing talents. Uh, check out. We got a legend autograph first here. We got King Kong Bundy, Master of the Five Count. <laughs> uh Awesome. Grew up watching King Kong Bundy, of course. One of the best big men that was really just a monster heel. He was awesome. Now, here is why I'm a little speechless, because I can't believe they pulled this off. Not only do we have everything you see here, a pop, signed autograph from a WWE legend, wrestling legend, okay? Not just WWF, but wrestling legend. Cool shirt and pin, okay? You'd think, that's enough right there. And the socks, I keep forgetting. And the socks, okay? Got a lot of things already. Look what they included. Heartbreak Kid Shawn Michaels autograph photo. I'm speechless. This is amazing. This is why that wrestling club is, is freaking awesome. Okay. How many other subscription boxes out there can say they have, first of all, autograph photos. Okay. On top of that, this quality of a superstar autograph photo. That is insane. I love it. This is awesome. So great job to that wrestling club. Amazing. All right, let's do a quick rundown because I think we got our cheat sheet in here. Let's see here. We got, uh, yeah, here is our list of December for that wrestling club. Now, didn't mention it at the beginning, but I'll share with you now. When you subscribe to that wrestling club, you got three options to go with. You've got the heavyweight box option, which is everything you see here. Okay, that means you're going to get the super duper autographs, the beautiful shirts, the pops, the elites, that kind of thing. You're going to get that in your heavyweight boxes. You'll get the more exclusive and uh, high dollar items. They have a cruiserweight box, which means you'll get some of what you see here or maybe a variant on something. Okay, then you have what's called the small package lapel pin box, which really is just the lapel pin. So you get that. So you can subscribe if you only want to get pins or you can subscribe to get... The Cruiserweight box, which is a little cheaper, but you don't get as great quality items sometimes. You'll get good items, but not the best. 
And then heavyweight box, you get everything you see here. Because I, I mean, I'm gonna get the heavyweight box every time because I don't want to miss out on anything. So here are the here, here's the full list of everything that was in the box. So for the heavyweight box, we have Andre the Giant T-shirt. We've got Cruiserweight. You get the Shawn Michaels autograph and the King Kong Bundy autograph. So you would have gotten both of these just by getting the Cruiserweight box. That's pretty awesome. Then everybody got the Funko Pop of Ronda Rousey. Then you have the Odd Socks Ultimate Warriors. And then the small package lapel pin was the Bray Wyatt lapel pin. So there you go. So if you want to subscribe, you get three options there. Again, December 2018. Uh, we're ending it on a very high note because there we go. We got two amazing autographs. Heartbreak Kids, Shawn Michaels, King Kong Bundy, Ronda Rousey Pop, Ultimate Warrior Socks, Bray Wyatt Pen, and Andre the Giant T-shirt. Love it! Super happy. So very cool. Thank you, that wrestling club. Again, you continue to amaze me. I can't wait to see what 2019 is going to be like. I can't wait to see what you got in store for us. So keep it going. Keep going strong as you guys have been. It's amazing. If you haven't subscribed yet, though, click on the link below in the description of the video. There is a Pop Culture Junkie promo code there. Use that to save 10% on your first box. Remember, as always, to check me out on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Please give me a thumbs up for the video. Please hit that subscribe button. Please leave me some comments as well. Everybody have a fantastic New Year's Eve and safe one as well. And I'll see you next year for another awesome unboxing. This is your host and friend, PCJ the Pop Culture Junkie, the Wrestling Junkie, the Pro Wrestling Junkie, saying to me, wrestling's always going to be real. I'm signing out.